Gothic Architecture by Alexis Garcia Table of Contents I'm going to talk a little bit about the introduction of Gothic Architecture and examples of Gothic Architecture. Intro to Gothic Architecture What is now called Gothic Art was originally called French Style and it was referred to as Architecture. Gothic refers to the style of visual arts and culture that first began in 1140 in the Ile de France. The religious significance of the height of these buildings is to suggest that they are reaching towards the heavens. Gothic style reached its peak in the 13th century. By the middle of the 16th century, the Gothic style was at an end in France, but it still continued to influence artists in Germany and England until the 17th century. Gothic style was developed from the Romanesque style, which are broad and massive, characterized by semicircular arches, thick walls, and closely spaced supports that create a feeling of security. The first truly Gothic building, early Gothic, was Saint Denis. It is located in Paris, France. It was built under a bot sugar around 1140. And there's a picture. The Cathedral of Notre Dame it is located in Paris, France, on the Ile de la Cite, an island in the Seine River. Bishop Maurice of Sully is the founder of the cathedral. Construction began in 1163 and finished 1235. However, reconstruction began almost immediately. The reconstruction included various parts of the cathedral. Flying buttresses were also added to stabilize its height and to help hold the weight of the roof. And here's another picture where you can also see the flying buttresses along the side of the building. St. Ch Chapel, the Holy Chapel, built by King Louis IX in the 13th century in Paris, France. The chapel is a rayonnet style of Gothic architecture, which means to shine or to radiate. King Louis IX was a center for the rayonnet style. When compared to other Gothic buildings, St. Chapel is really small. It was more of like a relic reliquary which housed the Holy Crown of Thorns and the Holy Cross. King Louis IX purchased the Holy Crown of Thorns for 135,000 livres, which is equivalent to about 200,000 US dollars today. The chapel was only 40,000 livres, which is about $49,000 today, US dollars. And that is a picture of the front of the cathedral. St. Maclau is located in Rouen, France. The church was designed in 1434 by Pierre Robin. St. Maclau is an example of flamboyant Gothic style, which was the final phase in the development of Gothic architecture. It is called flamboyant because of the flame-like carvings. Flamboyant is also French for flaming. Salisbury Cathedral is located in England. It was built between 1220 and 1258 by Nicholas of Eli. The difference between Salisbury Cathedral and normal Gothic structures is that it is low and wide with no real emphasis on height. Unlike France, which rely on flying buttresses for structural support, this cathedral has not much use of them. And you can see it only has three flying buttresses on each side. St. Patrick Cathedral in New York City, first constructed in 1858 and was halted due to the Civil War. Cardinal Tim Timothy Dolan has recently announced that the Archdiocese of New York is launching a 
$177 million renovation of the cathedral. This restoration is the most expensive restoration that it will undergo since it first opened 133 years ago.